everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I am going to be unboxing the Walmart Beauty Box for spring of 2023. Now if you're unfamiliar with the Walmart Beauty Box, this is a quarterly beauty subscription where you usually get beauty samples and some full size products each quarter. Order. This is one of the most affordable subscription boxes out there at $6.98 a quarter. Um, you do fill out a quiz when you sign up talking a little bit more about your beauty preferences and I think that that helps them select your box but I'm not 100% sure. And with that, welcome back to all the sub box lovers out there. Welcome if you're new. My name is Katrina and on my channel I unbox lots of different subscription boxes. So if you like these Walmart beauty boxes, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and make sure that you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future uploads. And let's dive in. I am so happy that you're here hanging out with me today unboxing the Walmart beauty box. This month it came in like a really beautiful like light baby blue color which I think is super cute. Um, I have variation number five according to the box here. For my winter box I was able to upgrade I think I paid like ten dollars or something and I was able to upgrade my box. I don't remember getting an email to be able to do that for the spring box so this is just like the regular beauty box the 698 box. When you open it up that is what it looks like. Like. All right, so inside it goes over everything that you could have gotten. Obviously, you don't get everything that's on here in the box. Um, but the theme for spring is beauty is in bloom. Leave dull, dry winter days in hibernation and wake up your self-care routine with new, freshly picked favorites. All right, let's see what I got. Ooh, the very first thing is actually really cool. Uh, we got a set of nails. These are the Kiss Gel Fantasy Sculpted Nails. Um, this is a full-size product and retails for $7.97. So just with this product here, it covers the cost of the box. Now I'm, don't do my nails. I'm just not a nail gal, but out of any nail that I've ever gotten in a box, these are ones that I truly might consider just because of how, I love the like matte neutral color of these. I think they're really, really pretty. Now these are a longer length of nails, but I think they're super cute and you get 28 nails and side so a nice little nail set all right up next it came in a little bag so that it wouldn't like if it opened it wouldn't get everywhere which i really appreciate it is a product from mark anthony this is the repair bond and re-sculplex repair and protect leave-in treatment the full size is 8.4 fluid ounces and retails for eight dollars and 47 cents this is just one fluid ounce so like a dollar's worth of the product so this is um for hair so it reinforces your hair from the inside out hydrates defrizzes and softens I'm curious to see like what does it smell like Ooh, oh I love that that's like sweet young sexy vibes like it gives a little it's like a little bit more sophisticated than high school but it gives that like high school fragrance I don't know I don't know but I like it a lot it's got like a strong vanilla to it, I think, too. So it says here that this will revive your tired tresses with this system that's clinically proven to make hair up to 111% stronger and 140% smoother and 129% shinier. Um, cool. I am excited to try this out. It's definitely an affordable product if it's something that I do like. Which is honestly the, what part of what I like about the Walmart Beauty Box is that everything in here is pretty affordable. So if you do fall in love with something, it's like it won't break the bank to go buy more of it. Up next, we have a product from CeraVe. This is their cream to foam cleanser. The full size is $12.47 and is 12 fluid ounces. This one is one fluid ounce. Um, I'm excited. This is for normal to dry skin, which is, I have oily skin. I have gotten a full size of this in the Dermy Doc box for, I think for spring, but I'm excited to have a little sample size. It's always nice to get little sample size cleansers. Um, and for a cleanser, I don't mind as much that it's meant for normal to dry skin. Um, and this does say that it removes makeup. So nice little CeraVe sample. This is great because if you're not sure whether or not you would like it, this type of cleanser, you can try it out in a smaller size. Okay, up next we have this here. This is Body Fantasies Japanese Cherry Blossom Body Spray. Uh, the full size is $5.99 and is eight fluid ounces. This is one fluid ounce. I'm not going to spritz it. I'm just going to open it the wrong way and just give it a sniff. I do. One of my favorite scents is the uh, Rituals Cherry Blossom type scent. So I'm curious to see. This probably will not smell the same, but I do like a Cherry Blossom scent. Ooh, I do like that. I smell alcohol. I'm going to be honest. The first thing I smell is alcohol in that. <laughs> so yeah, and the first ingredient on it is alcohol. Um, 
I'm sure once you spray it, you won't smell the alcohol. Like the others, you can get the cherry. It's a nice cherry blossom scent. I will put that out there. The problem is when you smell it like that, you just, the alcohol overpowers the whole thing. So, um, not bad, a nice little body mist. This is honestly a perfect little spring, like cherry blossom type fragrance, so love that. Then, from Neutrogena, I have their Hydro Boost Fragrance Free Hydrating Gel Cleanser. The full size is $8.99. Um, and is 7.8 fluid ounces. This is 0.5. Um, so it says drowning your moisturizers in oversized water bottles. Get all the hydration your skin needs with this luscious face wash. Um, I mean, I would still use a moisturizer after this, but I love Neutrogena's products and this seems really nice. Oh, okay. It's coming out. I should not have opened it. So this is not sealed, but it is just like a gel. It's fragrance free, so I don't even need to smell it, but it's just like a little gel cleanser. All right, up next, we do have a perfume from Cher, um, Cher Decades Collection EDP. It's a product will vary. Um, full size is $29.99 for one fluid ounce. So we've got a little perfume. This has top notes of Italian bergamot, peach nectar, and mandarin dew, heart notes of jasmine sambac and heliotrope, and base notes of vanilla bourbon, sandalwood, and amberette. Okay, I am going to spray this onto the little paper that's in here because I don't know if I'm going to like this or not. It sounds good, but you just never know. So I'm going to spray it on here just to see the scent. Oh, that is a very sweet scent. Uh, I wouldn't wear that scent personally. I'm not a big fan of super sweet scents. I like mine to be a little more like sexy versus like sweet and flirty for spring it probably makes sense and it does smell nice it's just this is a very a very like sweet candy like type of scent which just isn't really my vibe but i know some people love that so a nice little fragrance sample and then last but not least i got this from covergirl this is their clean fresh skincare color correcting serum moisturizers the full size is 14 dollars 98 for one fluid ounce and you get four different sample packets to try. Um, and it looks like it's by skin. These are by shades. So there's fair, light, medium, and deep as far as like the ones that you can use. So it's not like you can use all of them. You only maybe, I could probably try both of these. Um, cause sometimes I, well, I'm fair, but sometimes light will work on me. So I could try both of those. These would be too dark on me, but um, nice to try it. Apparently has niacinamide in it as well. Okay, and that is everything that I got in my Walmart beauty box for spring. Now let me go through some of the other products you could have gotten um, according to the pamphlet. So there's an EOS Shea Better 24 hour moisture shave cream, um, some false advertising faux lashes, the Kristen S Styling Reviving Dry Shampoo, the Thayer's Natural Facial Toner, there was a Maybelline mascara, so you could have gotten a full-size mascara. That would have been cool. Um, a Derma E Vitamin C Moisturizer and Serum. A Sweet Tooth by Sabrina Carpenter, I think, fragrance. Um, a Pink Sugar fragrance, potentially. Um, Nexus Color Assure Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, and then there was a Juicy Couture It's Sunny Honey um, perfume or fragrance too. Um, I'm happy with this box. It's like, it's a good box. It's not the best Walmart beauty box ever. The last one I really loved, but I also upgraded that box. I only got one full size product in this box this time. Sometimes you get more, sometimes you get less. I actually though think it's a decent mix of products. It seems like there's a heavy like look based on like what's listed here, a heavy thing on fragrance because I got both a body mist and a fragrance. This I would not wear. This I actually would wear. Um, and then I got some like moisturizing face washes. I think I'll use this. This smells really good, honestly. I want that in my hair. And then I don't really know about this. I need to read more about this, but it seems pretty cool. So definitely not a bad Walmart beauty box. Not my favorite, but for $6.98, I really can't complain about what's here. But I'm curious on your thoughts. What did you think of my Walmart beauty box for spring of 2023? And what did you get in yours? I know sometimes you can get products on here that aren't listed on the card. So I'm curious like did you get something that wasn't listed on the card did you get more full-size products less full-size products i would love to hear all of your thoughts down in the comments below i do pay for this box with my own money i don't know if i said that and i'll leave a link down below in case you're interested in signing up it's not affiliated or anything like that so i'll leave that in case you're interested in signing up if you like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure that you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future uploads and i'll see you in my next video